very, very welcome. If this is your um, first time, very, very happy, very lovely to, to meet you. <laughs> um, the first webinar we had was more of um, theoretical where, you know, we took everyone um, just basically how to use content as a marketing, um, you know, marketing strategy and basically social media. And then the second was more practical where we had the awesome Coyote Abbas um you know it was more of a practical session so he was tutoring and we had people that were practicing what he was saying and this third edition is you know valentine's is around the corner and we know a lot of people are going to start shopping so um we want you to be successful we want you to sell out on all your products or your services you know so that's why we have the very very awesome the sales master himself with us today <laughs> so i'll just take us through the <laughs> take us through the agenda let me try to share my screen hmm. okay let's see Well, please help me confirm if you can see my screen. I can see your screen loud and clear. Okay, all right, fantastic. So um, we'll start with the business intro for really doing through um, our part of the seller business. And this is me just, you know, basically welcoming all of you. And the next session will be by um, Temita Yola Dini. She's the growth marketing manager for Pixelab business. So she'll just do like a very short 15 minutes um, session on Pictola business. Uh, so if you're looking to sell your product online, you don't have to have a website where you have to pay for domain hosting and all that. We have a free platform where you can put your products and, you know, just sell and we'll support you for everything you need. So I don't know if Tim Mitayo is in yet. Okay, I don't think she's, I don't think she's in yet. So we'll just go straight into the session and Paul, you pardon me, whenever Tim is in, we'll just like take a short break. So she just does the session and then we can continue. No problem. So after Paul takes us through, it's going to be a very engaging session. Please don't be shy. Oh, Tim is actually a fantastic. Okay. Sorry, I didn't see. So um, let me just, I'm going to promote it to panelists. So after um, the session, we're going to have a Q&A. Please ask any questions that you have. Paul's going to answer them. And then we'll close by 9 p.m. or before. So a brief introduction about our speaker today. I'm sure a lot of you already know this speaker. I will always bring you the best. We always bring you the best people to come and, you know, come and teach us. <laughs> so Paul, who is the CEO of Sales Factory Africa, um, a sales recruiting training and media business. He's the author of six books and has been featured on CNN and other international publications. He has spoken twice on sales at his prestigious Lagos Business School and is currently the training director on sales for three multiple multi-billion Naira real estate companies. He's married to Vivian and together they are blessed with three children. So who not bring a single person to come and teach us how to sell him on time? <laughs> so so um, that's it. Um, Tammy, let me just, let me make you a panelist and then you can take us through the session. But I, is she already a panelist? Okay, yeah, she's ready. Yes, so, Tammy, are you ready? Hello, Timmy. Okay. Well, I think the floor is yours. Please turn on your video. We have to see your face. <laughs> I, I, I'm impressed if they say you Sorry. can't start your video because the host has stopped it. Can you do it from your end? Okay, let me see. Sorry, please, can you help me? I'm not sure why he can't turn on his video. Okay, I think. Are I you can. all good now? Okay, okay. all right. <laughs> I'm just going to get yeah. for you to just blow us away. <laughs> <laughs> all right, good evening, everybody. I didn't. All right. This is not my normal space. I just flew in from outside into <laughs> Lagos. 
I park my car somewhere. So I just say, I've got to do this. If not, traffic will, will stop me from getting home to my home study. Good evening, everybody. How's it going? I hope you're good. If you can hear me, please say yes, I can hear you, please. If you can hear me, put on the type on the chat box and say, yes, I can hear you. Can you hear me? Okay, everybody says yes, 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 yes. All right, so the yes, have it. Let's go, 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 go. Quick teller, thank you for having me. Gloria, thank you for reaching out. Thank you, everybody, all, every member of the team. Thank you guys for having me. We're going to have a good time today. We're going to learn a lot of things today. All I need from you is your participation. We put it in so that you can get the most and the best out of this class. Let me share my slides now and then I'll start teaching. All right. All right, my name is Paul Fu. I don't want to go much into it. You know, I run a sales company. We do sales training. We do sales recruitment for some of the biggest companies in the continent of Africa. And then uh, just Jane almost has been raising up her hand. Is it time for questions? Do you have something to say? Can you type it? All right. And we can unmute if it's a question that you have. Okay. So we can, she can unmute? Type it. Okay, she said it's error. So, okay. Okay, it's error. Okay. That's an error. All right, good. All right. So we're here because we want to see how do we make sales in this Valentine season that is coming. How do we take advantage of the season that is coming as a business person? You need to understand something about sales. Before I even go into how to make sales, we need to even understand, so what is sales? Because if you don't understand the definition of the word, the way you relate with the word will affect you. Let me drop this in first. Try again to this slide. What is sales? Sales is a process. Is a step by step process whereby you convince a customer, a person, a buyer that the product that you want to sell to them will give them more value than the money that they have in their pocket. Let me explain. I'm going to be to where I am. They took the light. They will bring the light back. So let me turn off my video, but I'll continue teaching. Sales is the process of convincing and persuading a person that what you are about to sell to them will give them more value or more benefit than the money that they will pay to get it. What that means is that you should raise the value like this more than the money that they pay. People should feel as if they cheated you. <laughs> Why? Because you have given them so much value. And that value usually is what they perceive. So if your customer does not see the value of what they are buying from you is your fault. If your customer does not see the usefulness of what they are buying for you is your fault. Let me give you an example. This is my phone. It's an iPhone 11 Pro. I bought this phone this year, last year, 415,000 Naira cash. Now, why would I buy a phone for 415,000? I would have bought something else. Now, look at it. The value that this phone has brought to me cannot be compared to the money that I, that I paid to acquire it. I'm being traded for QuickTeller now, is it not so? Somebody probably must have seen my video, referred me to QuickTeller people, and I'm here. It is this phone that I use. I just flew in from Abuja, where I went to do sales training at the Hilton. Now I call, uh, the Transcom Hilton in Abuja. I finished the sales training. I flew back. It was a video that somebody saw that he flew me in, into Abuja, paid 
give me big money to do sales training for them and then I'm back. It is this. So the value that this phone is giving to me is higher than the money that I paid to acquire it. Once you understand that, then you now understand what selling really, really means. When you now understand that, right, you will not be arguing about price. You'll be thinking about value. How many of you understand what sales is now? Yes or yes? Do you now understand it? Good. If you understand it, I say yes. Okay, everybody's saying yes, 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 please. Fantastic. Because I am very tactical in the way that I teach. Once you understand that, you now begin to say to yourself, what do people gain when they buy my product or my service? Because it is what they gain, that's what they are paying for. They're not paying for your product. They're paying for what they will gain. Why did I buy an iPhone? I bought an iPhone because, number one, functionally, it's a good phone. Number two, it's a status symbol. That's another thing I gain. When my clients see that I use an iPhone or I use an Apple computer, the way they perceive me will be higher. Does that make sense to anybody? Oh, oh my God, oh, I see this class. <laughs> that is what sales is. <laughs> oh, sorry, guys. Let me tell you guys ahead of time. I'm very dramatic with the way I teach you. Please forgive me. Some of you like who are quiet. I am not. My, I, I really want you to understand it. So I will be very dramatic. If you've watched my videos before, it is just the way I am. You know, I'm always in my elements. Okay? All right. Someone says, I sabi you. Someone says, I know you. Okay, fantastic. That's cool. Before you make sales this Valentine's season, it is important that you establish how much do you want to make in sales? What is the goal? How much do you want to make in sales between now and the first week of Valentine's? Remember, if you want to make sales this Valentine's season, you should start to build your campaign now. You don't wait till the week of Valentine's. You start building it now. So how much do you want to make? What is the specific figure that you want to make this Valentine's season? What is the goal? And why is that goal important to you? I like slide, but let me teach. How much do you want to make between now and the first week of Valentine's? And why is that goal important to you? Why is it important to you? Because why? It is your why that will drive you and not the goal. It is what the goal will do for your business. That is what will compel you to go the extra mile. That is what will compel you not to come with an excuse. So why do you want to make the money you want to make this Valentine's season? Why is it important to you? So that what? So if you make 10 million naira extra in this Valentine's season, or you make 2 million naira extra, why is that important to you? You want to use to expand your business. You want to send your children to a better school. You want to open a shop. You want to order more products. You want to start a new product line. Why, why, why? There is nothing that drives human beings to do things than when they have a strong why. Guess what? If your why is strong enough, you will come up with any how. The how is never a problem. It is the what and the why. That is the most important part in it. So write it down. How much do you want in sales? Write it down. Write it down in a place where you can see it on a regular basis. Because when you do that, you start to program yourself and program your mind to have the consciousness of that goal. How much do you want? Write it down. The next question I want to ask you is, why is that goal important to you? If you've answered that question, I want someone to tell me, why is, why is your Valentine sales goal important to you? Can someone tell me? 
One or two people, just two people. Why is it important to you? So that what? Anybody wants to share? Why is it important to you? I want to use this pay for school fees. Fantastic. Yes. Who else? Wear my glasses. Abola, I said I want to use the pay for pay my school fees. Yes. Who else? Why is making sales this Valentine's season important to you? Who else? Who else? Come on, man. Sales rules. It is important to me to expand my business. Okay. Okay, fantastic. Now, so I am seeing the reasons why some of you want that particular goal for yourself. I need money to expand. Good. Now, now you have the you have the you have the you have the fuel that will drive you to push you forward. Next, the next thing you want to ask say to yourself is you want to do what I call walk backwards. You want to now start walking backwards. I said to yourself, okay, if I want to make pay off my car loan, good. If I want to make five million naira, or I want to make three million naira in Valentine's sales, you want to ask yourself, how many products do you need to sell to hit that target? Let me show you a slide. Let me show you a slide. Let me jump onto a slide. So when you want to achieve your goal, there's something called being strategic and being tactical. Please watch this. This is very important. The goal that you say you want is your strategy. That's what you want. Two million, three million. That's where you are going to. It gives you direction. The next step is, what are the tactical steps that you will need to take to ensure that the goal that you have set for yourself becomes a tangible physical reality. Let me explain. Your practical steps could be A, write down the names of all your past clients that did business with you in 2021. Everybody who paid you money in 2021. Everybody who bought a product from you. Everybody who made an inquiry from you. Write all their names down. Man, now some of you, it may be a challenge because you don't even have a documentation of your past client. You don't have like an Excel sheet whereby you can pull it up and see all the past clients that have done business, you know, with you. So write down all their names. The next thing you will do is you will pick up your phone. You will call each and every one of them. Remember, you have a goal. It is this step that will make it happen. You will call them and say, you know what? I have a Valentine package for all my clients. And this package is to start officially on Susan and so day. But because you are an existing customer, that's why I'm calling you early. I'm calling you early because if you buy now, this and this and this is what you will get for buying now. That is a tactical step. Let's say, for example, you have 20 customers, 50 customers, and you truly say, like you said, you know why you want the goal. You pick up your phone and you call each of these customers. A few of them will buy from you. But how will you call them if you don't have an offer? Before you call your customers, you must have what they call a sales offer. What is a sales offer? A, your sales offer means what you want to, or the special Valentine package that you would like to offer the customer. There are certain things that must be in an offer. Number one, the offer must have an expiry date. Write it down. The offer must have an expiry date, number one. Can you hear me, please? Can you guys hear me? I can hear you. Okay, good. The offer must have an expiry date. Why? People like you to give them a sense of urgency. You need to tell them that this offer starts at so so and so time and it ends at so so and so time. Two. Number two, 
you must bump up the offer. You must sweeten the pot of the offer. Remember I told you, people always want to feel as if they are cheating you. Make them feel that way. So you want to ask yourself, what can I add to this offer? What else can I add to it? Can I give them a free delivery? Can I give them a, a scarf? What can I add to this offer that will make it more attractive to them? Did you get that? So you write it down. You can either use a video to do the offer or you can write it down. You can actually combine both. Really, videos have a higher conversion rate than every other form of doing marketing into this. If you are a small business owner and you're not doing video marketing, I am sorry for you. You are leaving a lot of money on the table. I just did a sales training for a law firm in London. I live in Lagos. I don't live in London. The law firm saw my video. Let me show you that video. This is the video. Let me open the slide for you. So I, I want you guys to hear that particular um, video. One second, please. Where is my slide? Um, one second, please. No. Uh, Treats. Awesome. All right. I really want you guys to get the fullness of this class. All right. So I want you guys to watch this video. I did it on Instagram and they gave me this sale in the UK. If you can hear the video, let me say yes. Can you hear the video? No. Okay, I know what to do now. For you to hear the video, I'll take off this video. Yes. Can you hear it now? Every sales ever yes. made or can you hear it now? Somebody Good. Yes. because somebody contacted you. Hi, my name is from Africa's number one sales coach. Sales is a contact spot. Do you know that? If you are not calling somebody, if you are not texting somebody, if you are not voice noting somebody, if you are not DMing somebody, how are you going to sell? The more contacts you make, the higher the probability you're going to close some sale and secure the bank. So do that right now. Good. So this video brought me this sale in, in this law firm in the UK. Why? Because videos, the conversion rate for videos is way higher than any other form of content. So what I would want for all of you to do right now for me is, in preparation for your Valentine, I would like for all of you to create a video offer. Use your face. Don't be honest, I am shy, people. Use your face. There's something about the authentic nature of your face. They already know you. Use your face. You all of you have a phone. Use a smartphone to do a video. And just send it out. Now, the day I sent out this video, did I know that a law firm in London will call me that has three branches? No! The moment you send the video out, the video takes a life of its own. Does that make sense? Oh! Hey! When you send the video out, you increase the probability that somebody may buy. You increase the chances that somebody may buy. You didn't get that. So make the offer. But another thing that will make the offer strong again is the title of the offer, the headline of the offer. The reason why somebody would click your offer is when your offer is the headline or the caption of the offer is enticing. Let me share you a story about the power of a caption. In 1982, a woman by the, an American, a woman by the name of Nora Aiden, she wrote a book called Astrological Love. 
The book didn't do well. The book sold only 2,000 copies, and the woman was discouraged. One man now read the book, he picked up the book in the bookshop. He now called the woman and said, Madam, I read this your book, I like this your book. Can I buy the publishing rights of this your book? The woman said yes. So she sold the rights to the guy. The guy did not change the content of the book. He only changed the caption. The woman called the book Astrological Love and sold only 2,000 copies. The man changed the title and called the title How to Satisfy a Woman Every Time and Have Her Beg for More. That book went on to sell 2.5 million copies. Whoa! <laughs> the only thing that changed was the caption. The content was the same. If you to click on your Valentine offer. The caption must be powerful. Let me give you a framework on how to write caption and I will wait for you guys. I will give you guys a short assignment. All of you will write captions for your Valentine offer and I will hear some of them. And let me give you the following frameworks. Number one, the how-to framework. We used to that. How to lose weight. How to make money online. How to yada, 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 yada. I don't know. Just come up with something. You can use frameworks that have to do with... Um, numbers like 15 ways to lose weight 15 ways to i don't know have a clear skin some offer so right now waiting for all of you write an enticing valentine offer right now get on the chat box i'm waiting everybody run there now are they wait are they wait write a caption that you can use for your valentine offer either on a flyer or on a video or on a text write it down i'm waiting get there how to say i love you Whoa, i like that come on man i'm waiting how to become a data scientist i like that you can use that 10 ways to make your man stay Whoa, I miss out. I miss out. Hey. how to make your man pop the pressure Get your design. Oh my God, bro. We're gonna go here. Change. How to make money while sitting down. Oh, now, nah. man, these guys are dangerous. Wow, 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 wow. How to get your husband to give you what you want. Five steps to secure cheap land in Nigeria. I like this. I like this. Wow, 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 wow. Come on, man. I need my, need my, need my, need my, need more. I need more. Wow, these headlights are powerful. 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 On that one here. Three ways. Free delivery for food items. I like this. Three ways to a man's art. Zainab. Five ways to blow in Nigeria. That word blow is, is very, very powerful. <laughs> wow. Five ways to show love on a budget. Oh, I like that one. Five ways to show love on a budget. Find out. Click on this link to find out. I like that. Wow. So now you get it right. You get it right. You get it right. When you write an headline like that, it captivates somebody to want to hear you out. So how do you put this headline so that people will see it? You put it on a video. You put it on a written door. It will bring the light. I'm not in my house. So I just flew in from Abuja now. But I stopped at a hotel on the airport road, packed, paid them to do this webinar. Because as an entrepreneur, you don't give excuses. I hope you learned a lesson now. You do not give excuse as an entrepreneur. You must get the job done. When they tell your customer, say, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. You don't see, see traffic. No excuse. I could have told Quitella that I didn't do, I didn't do. No, no excuse. Gloria doesn't even know this. It's not that she's even knowing. I am actually on the airport. I live in Lekki. I live in Lekki. I parked on the road, paid a hotel to do this webinar here because there's no excuse. I knew when I saw this coming. So I bought an extra internet. No excuse. Entrepreneurs, you get the job done. I hope somebody got this right now. You must give exceptional customer service. No excuses. Yes, I'm on the road. I'm not in my house. Those of you who watch my videos a lot, you know my, my, my space is very fine. 
And I, and I wrote that day, no excuse if you want to make money. Good. So now, you put that caption in a, either in a video or in a text. Now, some of you are saying, ah, I don't know how to edit. I don't know how to edit video or stuff like that. It's very simple. Not a problem. What you can do is this. I, there are two apps that are very, very good for you to edit video. You can use InShot app or Pre Premiere Rush. Those apps are very, very good to edit videos and bring out the best in your video. Somebody say, what if you don't feel comfortable? What if you don't feel comfortable showing your face? Can you rely on reels? Oh, yes, you can rely on reels. You can do reels. You, can, you don't have to show your face. It's not a must that you show your face. You can do reels. Now, the purpose of all this thing I'm telling you to do is to do what? Is to get attention. When you do this video and you do this caption, people start to send you a DM. Is it not so? Talk to me now. They will send you a DM. True of us. They will call your line. True of us. Okay, the editing app. You can use InShot. I use InShot to edit my videos. InShot or Premiere Rush. I pay, I, I, I use the paid version. You can use the free one. I pay $14 to use InShot for the whole year. And I, I pay $4 a month to use Premiere Rush. So the video, if you see that promotional video that I did for QuickTeller, I use Premiere Rush to edit that video on my phone. On my phone, that's all. All right, good. Then, now, what is the purpose of all these things? The idea of all these things is to get people to call you. It's, you are doing what we call magnetic marketing. When you send this thing out, it will get people to call you. Now, let me give you guys an example. The company I went to do sales training for in Abuja, it's a very big company. They hosted me at the Hilton, the Transcorp Hilton in Abuja. The owner of the company is in my WhatsApp. I want to give you guys one secret now, how to make sales. In my WhatsApp, I have a broadcast list, not a group. No, a list is different. I have a list of very rich men and women in that my group, in, in that my broadcast. Now, not every day, but once a month, I send them an important information. Did you see what I'm saying now? I either send them a report, I send them an article so that I am in their consciousness. Now, when the owner of this big business wanted a sales trainer for his company, who do you think he remembered? He remembered me. Why? Because I have been nurturing it. It's called a nurture campaign. One way for you to make sales is that you must constantly be nurturing people in your network. What do you have on your WhatsApp status? What you put on your WhatsApp status is also a nurturing campaign. 30 seconds video about your business with a clear call to action. One of my clients who is in real estate, she just sold two houses from our WhatsApp status for 50, 50 million. I told her, put the video there. If it expires after 24 hours, put it again. After all, Coca-Cola always leaves their advert all over the place. True or false? They don't remove it. Because the more you see it, the more you believe in the brand. Does that make sense to anybody? When they understand something so good. Now, the purpose of having an headline, all right? and broadcasting it to, to people in your network, making those sales calls, the purpose of it is to so that you can have a conversation with people. Well, so I, I went to coach a company in Abuja, so I just flew back. So I asked one of them, how did you close your research? She just, the person just closed a sale of 150 million naira. So I asked her, how did you close that sale? She said, we ran an ad using the headline uh, framework you taught us. We ran the ad. And somebody sent me a DM because of the ad. Good. Are you seeing the flow now? From the DM, I called the person. Are you seeing now? From ad to DM to telephone. She now said from the telephone call, we now went for site inspection. After the site inspection, I followed up on the clients for another two weeks. 
before the client paid for the property. So you see the flow, see the flow. Ads with a good caption. DM. You see I'm now? Phone. Then site inspection. Then follow up. Close. How many steps is that? How many steps is that? How many steps I call man right there? Man right there, follow me. Okay? <laughs> How many steps did I call? Instagram sponsored ad. DM number two. Telephone call number three. Um, um, site inspection number four. Follow up number five. Closing number six. Process it before this person closes sale. Ask Gloria. Gloria, where they work for Quick Teller. Gloria sent me a DM. I called her. I mean, she called me. We, but we shall talk on the phone. From phone conversation, we exchanged email. And I'm here. Are you seeing the step? Gloria probably saw my video or somebody told her about me. Are you seeing the flow? flow? So there must be attention, which is marketing. Then, telephone conversation number two. Are you seeing the flow? Are you seeing the flow? Oh, God, no. These people, God, help me. You see, it's their head. Oh, this is too sweet. <laughs> Pamela say, yes. People say, yes, sir. Oh, yes, my people. <laughs> I'm really enjoying this class. My goodness. Say, so someone say, they enter, they enter, they enter. <laughs> Lovely, 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 lovely. Good. So that's the step. The purpose of all this, your headline, is so that somebody can call you. Now, when they call you or when you call the customer, when do you go talk? How many of you know that a lot of times in the process where some of you have problem is you don't know how to close the sale on the phone? True of us. True of us. How many of you are this table? I'm in open and they say one they shake. So I'm gonna not be close sale for phone at all. If I some of an asset on a buy on a problem, no refund, no exchange. No refund, no exchange, no cost, only GM. That's how you get money. <laughs> Take it easy. Now, let me show you how to close sale on the phone. Gloria, please, I want somebody to be on video. I want to practicalize with somebody on video. Who wants to play with me right now? Who would like to play pretend with me right now? If you want to volunteer, just raise your hand and hold. Anyway, so I, I, I want the person to be on video. I want to demonstrate it. Are you see, I'm taking you guys through a process. So I started with the headline. I started with the marketing. So now they are calling you now or you are calling them. I want to show you the frameworks that you can use to close sales on the phone this Valentine. Event Spice. Good. Event Spice. Let me walk with you. Event Spice. Put on your camera if you can. Then put on your audio. Are you ready? Good evening, ma'am. Hello, Event Spice. We can't hear you. I have promoted you. Does that mean if you have any problems? Event Spice. Okay, I think she's rejoining. She's rejoining. Okay. She's in now. Okay. Hello, Event Spice. How are you doing? I'm fine. Good evening, sir. How are you doing today? Fine. How about you? I'm on top of my game, man. I'm on God's face. Hello? So now, Event Spice. Event Spice. Okay. I want to pretend as if I saw your ad or I saw your content online, right? Okay. So I'm calling to make inquiry from you. Okay. So, so give me some context. Which offer okay, do you have for Valentine? What is your what's your Valentine offer? 
Okay, uh, Valentine, actually we don't have any, but let me just create one. We have for surprise or wedding or marriage proposal. Yes, do a surprise. No, not, not everybody could do proposal. It's just do a surprise. Surprise your loved one now. Okay, surprise your right. loved ones. Okay, so let me call you now. I want to see okay. how you close. Then okay. I will now do it for you. Hello, okay. ma'am. Good evening, ma'am. How are you doing? Oh, good evening, sir. My name is Musumola, Event Spice World. What's your name, please? My name is Paul Fu. I You are in my contact because I saw your WhatsApp that you just sent now about you know, this Valentine's season. I want to, like, surprise my wife, you know? All right, so, yeah. But now tell me more about this. Thing. I'm interested. I, I like the caption that you put. I should uh, spice up my, my love life this Valentine's season. <laughs> tell oh, that's me more. I like very to nice. My, okay. my wife. Mm. Okay. Um, first of all, I would like to ask what are the things she likes that will actually get her hope there? What are the things she likes? My wife is a, she's a romantic. She likes all these romantic things. Where we are. Me, I'm me, a boy boy. <laughs> she likes romantic things. I don't know. That's what she likes. I don't know. Uh -huh. Okay. How about we organizing just an, an, uh, a movie night for both of you? Mm. All decorated and just one of our favorite movie in so somewhere, you know, private, just both of you. Mm. Will be food, there will be drinks. So our, our children are not going to join. Oh, uh, no, they can take children to the to, to the to your parents or to the nanny, just both of you, you know, just to your love for that day. Okay. Uh -huh. <laughs> uh -huh. Okay. I don't hear. Thank you. Oh, uh, why? Why did you say you don't like? You don't like the option. Heard. No, I no. It's very nice. I've heard. Very nice. Thank you very much, ma'am. Okay, so should I be expecting a call back for us to yes. further this production? Yes. Next week, ma'am. I'll call you next week. Okay. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you very much. Let's go for event spice, everybody. <laughs> you guys just call me. I don't have any marry any surprise. I don't uh, have event spice, event spice, event spice. I want you to call me now. I want to be your I want to be the event spice. Let me show you how to sell. Call me. Okay, hello. Hello, how are you doing, ma'am? Okay, good evening. Am I on to event spice well, please? Yes, this is event spice. Okay, so a friend of mine shared your um, um Valentine package. Uh, so I would like to make inquiry. How does it work, please? Thank you very much. Thank you for calling, ma'am. Now, madam, before we go further, is it okay if I ask you a few questions so I can really save you well? Okay. Yeah? Good. So yes, I'm what is yours. important? Good. So what is important to you in this Valentine's season for you and your partner? What would you want to see? Uh, it to me is a is a period of uh, appreciation, um, appreciate, uh, appreciation the other person, like mm -hmm. making him feel loved and um, mm -hmm. feel on top of the world that is the best. That's just what I want to achieve this period. Fantastic. So, what kind of setting would you want? And it's intimate setting with, with just you and him, or you want a a, a, a Actually, friend. prefer just me and him. You know. Let's you know, just doing something unusual that you're not used to doing, bit like bringing out the ultra ego of ourselves. That's just it. Fantastic. Would you want to have this in your house or outside your house? Anyway. Okay, fantastic. The most important thing is so, just both of us. Just two of you, fantastic. What kind of music, yeah. what kind of thing do you think he will appreciate? Uh, we really don't have any spectacular, like any specific, anything nice, anything we can just dance to or just not die to, yeah. Fantastic. So if, then, if, then if you want something special for him, anything nice, any spe anything nice that two of you can just dance to and an intimate setting for just two of you, then we have a package called the Valentine Package for Couples, the Intimate Valentine Package couple so okay. you have a, a bottle of wine okay you have some flowers okay you have a two-course meal okay and then all of them will be delivered to the location that you choose okay 
would you want it to be a surprise or you want it or you want to tell him ahead of time uh i prefer it to be a surprise be more appreciated when it's a surprise you know fantastic fantastic, fantastic. so this offer has started and that's what a lot of people who came to take this offer said when they came all right so if this or if this is what you spoke about then we are then this offer is perfect for you right now the offer is going for eight thousand naira, and by okay. next week when we're getting closer to the valentine we'll raise it to fifteen thousand naira. when would you want to start okay so uh can i call you back about the like perhaps i want to have one or two let me just digest the package you just suggested and i'll give up to you okay when you say you would get back to me usually when people say they will get back to us it's either two things it's either because of the price or they're not sure yet which one is it for you hello 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 let's give her a round of applause let's clap for her how many of you noticed how how i sold to her and how she sold to me who saw Hello? the difference? Yes. <laughs> so, events five. Present, sir. <laughs> so, so, I said usually when people say they would get back to us, it's, it's either because of the price or because they are not sure yet. Which one is it for you? Uh, I want to add, I want to think about it and perhaps add to your present offer because I realize that maybe what you're offering is not up to what I want. Okay. Like maybe it's too small because you may mention okay. of just two cost meal and you sent to my chair. So I want someone that will take over everything because I don't want to bring any substitution to him. Like I don't I won't take my hands off it. So I'll have to think, maybe look for a place and tell you about the place and we'll continue from if you if by the time I update you about my own offer, they will not come to a compromise like price. Fantastic. Or Fantastic. Why don't we do it this way? Because some, you know the, why don't we do this way? Because why don't we do this way? Because you know your partner more than me. Why don't we speak by Thursday next week or Friday this week about 9 or 10 p.m. 10 a.m. Then you can now put out a list of all the things you would want to see on that day. Is that okay? Okay. That's fine by me. So I'll call you by <laughs> 9 a.m. on Friday. Is that okay? Okay, no problem. Have a fantastic day. <laughs> why are you laughing? <laughs> Why are you I, I, I enjoyed the conversation. You took your time. Good. That's how to sell. You took your time and you were not ready to give up. Yes. You said you will call me 9 a.m. And yes. I was trying to turn you down. You're saying, no, ma. Yes. No, yes. how about you're yeah, just trying to give me suggestion like, okay, do any and I will work it out. Okay. Give her a round of applause. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> Gloria, I want two other people to do it by themselves. This, I will just observe them. Is that okay? Yes, sure. So um, who, who wants to play? Who are the two people that want to play? Just raise who your hand if you want me to highlight you. Okay. Some people, John's hand is raised up, two participants hands, right? so you can just speak to John and somebody else. John, so John, put on your mic so that we can hear two of you. John, is it, are we Tega, one other person? Tega, okay then. We, we can use, okay. So John, go ahead. John and Tega, can you hear me? Hello, John. Please give them a second. I think they're trying to sign back to the list. Hello, I can hear you. Hi, am I on to Tega? Yes, you are on. Okay, so John, what's up? I think John is still trying to sign in. Okay. Or oh, somebody else, is there any other person? Is yes, let me, who, who should I pick? Let me pick Jane. Yeah, Jane, yeah, Jane, yes, that's fine. Okay, then. I think John is here. 
So John is here. <laughs> All right, so Jay John and Tega, let's go. Tega, give us some context. What well, you want to be the salesperson, or John wants to be the salesperson? Yeah. Mm. Hello. Sorry, let me bring that up. Oh. And the background noise is too much. Who's that? Who wants yes. to sell? Let me, Let's let make me this fast, back. guys. Let me bring in Or. Oh. I'm bring. Okay, I'm bringing back Jane. Mm. So Jane and take our boat in now. Can you hear me? So start. We can hear you. So start. Hello, Tega. Mm-hmm. Take a Hello, Jane. Good, good. So sell, sell. Give, give us some. Give us some. Give us some background first. Okay. Um. I sell um handmade or handcrafted um gift items. So um, Tega, do you want to call? Okay. I would like for Tega to call you because she saw something, and Tega maybe wants to buy for okay. a staff or. A, I, I, I loved one somebody. Okay. So let me hear how hard I go. Just go. Hello, Jen. Hello, good evening. Good evening. Good evening. I saw your adverts on Instagram. Okay. Good evening. Um, Jane yeah. speaking. Which of the adverts did you see, please? Advert of you selling a gift box, which contains oh. some lovely items. And I would like to get that for my mom as a Valentine mm. gift for her. Fantastic. Oh, splendid. Thank you for calling, Tega. All right. Um, uh, looking at the advert, will you be interested in all the items um, we have on offer? Or would yes, you like I'll to be interested. Hello, Tega. Would you like to personalize some of the items or would you like exactly what you see um, on the offer. I would love to personalize like some question. items for her. Uh, that's a good question. Okay, great. So, um, would you like to personalize with her name initial or with a full name? Um, and there are five items on offer. So, if you opt for a personalization, I can throw in a free gift wrapping or a free, a free key ring. Mm -hmm. Okay, uh, personalization of just our first name only. That's what I want on the items. Okay, so um, do you have any preference with color? Pink, metallic, mm. gold? Mm. Um, I think, uh, I don't even know have this color. Uh, let me just go with red. Red, okay. Red yeah. is just perfect for the season. You cannot go wrong with red. So for yeah. the free... I'm going to throw in a really lovely heart-shaped red key ring for mommy. And I'm sure wow. she'd love that. Yes, we are excited to have it. Okay, so for us to conclude, because um, we're trying to wrap up with um, deliveries. So when would you like to have yours? Okay, I'll have mine delivered on the 13th, so I can give it to her on the 13th Okay, you know what? We can even speed up the delivery and have it over to you on the 12th. So Wow, that's how... that's amazing. All right. So how about we you know, wrap this up? Um, I'm going to send you the details. Is this your number? Is, uh, is this the number I can send? Uh, I'm not totally the price. Though. You're not totally price. Though. I'm assuming the price is on the offer, on the advert. <laughs> that's yeah, that's my assumption. Right, right. Closer, closer. No, 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 no. no. Right. You have to, there you are. Then you, you're not ask her. You want, to, you want to do a direct transfer or you want to pay with card? Okay, okay. Yeah, All right, yeah, yeah. So you're assuming right. it's called assumptive selling. Good. Okay, okay. All right, Tega. Um, so mm -hmm. would you like to pay via um, bank transfer or, or link. would you link. want me to send you um, a quick teller link? No, I would like to pay via ah, bank good. transfer. So just send me your account good. details via DM. Lovely. Ah!
<laughs> wow, this is so lovely. What did you guys learn? Take on uh, Jane. Was it Tegan that was selling or Jane? Jane was selling. I was the one buying. Jane. Okay, Tega, what did you learn? And Jane, what did you learn? Tell us. For me, mm -hmm. what I learned from Jane, why she was selling, she was not giving space for me to just slow down and think. Maybe just say, okay, I will call you back or let me think about mm. it. She was just trying to put in more words mm. for me to make my decision on time and make sure I pay, I make payments. And, and she also, really got, she really got to your, to your heart so emotionally. Yes. When she said, "Mommy will like this," that one touched me. <laughs> ah, I said, "This get a bad girl. Can I weekend girl?" <laughs> Right. Okay, so for me, um, um, Jane speaking now, for me, I noticed uh, from her voice that she was a bit hesitant and unsure, and I did not want to give her a lot of room to think or process, because mm -hmm. she has already said something for her mom, so I, yeah. you know, uh, played to her sentiments. I just, um, I wrote on that, so I didn't give her a lot of uh, processing time. And secondly, she stated her, her need for, for it on the 13th. So I just thought, mm -hmm. you know, bringing it uh, nearer would even endure her. So you even, you even went the extra mile by saying do it on the 12th, which was powerful. Yes. Yeah. One hour yes. with that. Yes. Yeah. Which was good. Which was powerful. Thank you. Well done, guys. Clap for them again Thank one more time. This was so good. This was so good. This was so, good. so guys, you now see... When, they, when you're in front of a customer or when a customer calls you, don't ever rush to sell. Repeat after me, write it down. Say, I will never rush to sell. I must ask questions. Write it down. I want to at a shout and say, I will never rush to sell. I must ask questions. Write it. Write it. Oh. I want that to enter your brain. Never ever rush to sell. Always ask questions. Always. Why? Because you don't even know what they want. Don't be selling like below boom market people. Come and buy, they'll be dragging your hand. A local way of selling. You're global. Ask questions. Selling is asking questions. Gloria, when am I meant to stop? Um, everything plus the Q and A, 830. Because selling is asking questions. It is. It asks me question. Now, I gave you some practical steps. Pick up your phone and call everybody that has ever bought anything from you before. Tell them you have an offer. If you, if you have never, if you have not created your Valentine offer, go and create it and run ads on it. I'm telling you. You either run paid ads on it or you do organic ads on it, which is you calling people and letting people know. You don't need to use a designer. Go and download this app for Canva. I have it here. Go and design your own Valentine offer. Go and get pictures online, you know, of love and Valentine and design something. Let people know that you have XYZ offer in place. If you don't call the customers, naturally, they will not call you because a lot of the app, Canva, C-A-N-V-A. Write it down. C-A-N-V-A. It's my favorite app. I pay $12 to use the app every single month. I, I mean, I pay for all my apps because I want to put the pay for my service. I don't do free. I pay for the app that I use. Right? Good. Canva is a very easy app to use. Very lovely. Even my slides, I use, I use Canva too. To, um, to, to do them, all right? Call each and every person, practice this thing. Let me give you one secret that can help you close more sales this Valentine. Call somebody and practice this sales pitch with the person that you know, maybe your cousin, your brother, your sister. Tell the person, I want you to pretend to be my customer uh, and then me, I will pretend to be the other person and run all these questions with that person. Next way for you to make sales Valentine's season is collaboration. Everybody write, shout collaboration. Say collaboration. How do you collaborate? You want to ask yourself a question. Who is doing business 
with the kind of people that I want to do business with. Who is doing business with the kind of people that I would want to do business with? So for example, you want to see, how can I collaborate with someone that sells clothes? Can you do an Instagram live together? Can you bundle a product together? That's collaboration. Can you distribute? Your... There's one company that they have a serious distribution strategy. Let me show you the company. Wait. Let me show you that company. I'm sure you will know them. But let me just show them to you. Uh, one second. I have these guys here. So come, so come. Yeah. Nah. Nah. I want to show you the name of the company. They are very, 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 very good at distribution. It's a Nigerian company. I like using Nigerian examples a lot. Just wait, you'll see them now. I'll show them to you now in a second. I want to show you the picture. Good is this company. I don't know if you know this company. I don't know if you know them. Can you see my slides? I don't know if you know no. real fruit. Yes or yes? You're not presenting. Oh. Oh, sorry. Good. Fantastic. I don't know if you know this company. Come write it down if you know them. Say yes, I know that real fruit. Gloria, these guys, eh, these people, eh, I've never seen a young Nigerian business that have a solid distribution strategy like this people. Gloria, can you hear me? Yes, so I hear you. They are every they are in shop rights, they're in Ebano, they are in every year. They're in the supermarket close to where I live. They are everywhere. Why? They know how to do collaboration. Do you know that I went to my gym? <laughs> he said me to go and swim. As I was climbing upstairs, I saw real food that stand in my gym. In my gym! There are a lot of gyms. Why? They understand collaboration. They always ask themselves the question, who is currently doing business with the kind of people that I want to do business with? That is collaboration. So I want to ask you guys this question. Who will you collaborate with this Valentine season to make sales? Who will you collaborate with? Is it a, a, a physical store? Is it like a supermarket? Is it like an influencer, a mini influencer? Some of you are in WhatsApp groups. And nobody knows what you do in the WhatsApp groups. You're in a big WhatsApp group of 300 people. And nobody knows. You're in a Facebook group. And nobody knows that you, are, you sell XYZ. Why? You have never let people know. Listen to me. A closed mouth is a closed pocket. I mean, I, I don't close my mouth. To I every year I say what I do. Every year. But if you don't open your mouth, you will be hungry. You will be hungry. So I want to ask you, who can you collaborate with in this season? Who can you work with in this season? Who can you do Facebook Live with? Who can you do Instagram Live with? Where can you distribute your product? Where can you put your product? This is how you do distribution. The lady that does event spice, for example, uh, all these people that do marriage counseling, do they know you? Do you get me? So this is how you're thinking about collaboration. I want you to think around that. Who can I collaborate with? That way, you begin to expand your tentacles, expand your reach. Because the more people that know you, the higher the probability that somebody may or is going to buy something from you. So at this point, I want to ask you guys a question. What will you do differently because of all that you have heard tonight? Don't tell me it was powerful. Don't act like a Nigerian. I was just glorious. I don't want that. What did you learn specifically? That if you drop the mic now, I will do it tomorrow. Tomorrow. Who wants to share? What 
different action will you take? How many of you have started writing the names of your past customers in a sheet of paper? Okay, Daniela, go ahead and speak. Okay. Hello, Daniela. Yes. Was it a mistake? No, no. Right. So, what will you do differently? Me? Yes, and immediately, yes. Take action. I would start using what they recommended to me in the questions. They say I should use quick seller to quick customer. Seller, good. Good. So, so I want to good. ask, does quick seller still need adverts? What are the advantages? Um, sorry. Uh, Gloria, I'm just Gloria, I'll, I'll, yeah, I'll, I'll, thank you very much, Daniela. Um, it's not yet time for Q and A. Um as soon as Paul is done, we'll just have a Q and A session, and Timita will answer all your questions. I hope that works. Thank you. Okay. okay. I want this to that. Pamela, go ahead. I want to hear people. I like to hear people's voices. John, tell me what will you do differently. Pamela, what will you do differently? Pamela, say I will. In, I intend to start documenting all my past customers. I'll go and create an offer. Vents, but it can go on. Who wants to speak? Pamela, go ahead. Yeah. Hello. Yeah. Yeah. Go ahead. Hello. Okay, so if uh, events wise, I will take my time to ask questions as then this time around, am I spending one hour to engage my customers, ask them questions, then we we'll be able to close the deal, like take more time than I did before now. Then also do more of video. Rush, so. yes. yes, do more of um video speaking, marketing. Speaking about video events, and I'm talking to everybody here. One thing that you can, all of you can start doing now is to do Instagram Reels. Let me give you one secret. Instagram is trying to copy Snap, uh, TikTok. So any reel you do, eh, the algorithm favors it. Do you know that I, had, I grew by 1,000 followers recently from Instagram Reels? I went to speak, I went to do a sales training in Dubai, came back on the 19th of December. From 19th of December, so the first week of January, I had over 1,000 new followers because I was putting an Instagram reel almost every day. Some of them had 10,000 views, 5,000 views. Some of them had 250 saves. So let me give you guys one secret. Go and shoot one one-minute video about your business and put it on Instagram reel. You will come back and share a testimony. It's powerful. But when you put a video, you must always have a call to action. Your video must have a call to action. What's a call to action? Click on this link. Go here. Never finish a video and say, with these few points of mine, hope I'll be able to convince you. <laughs> Are you a debater? Oh. Never finish a video and say, thank you. That's are you a singer? Have a clear call to action. So click on this link. Buy this. Go here. That is how to sell. Somebody else, what have you learned? Uh, open it up for question. What have you learned? Who do I unmute? Okay, let me unmute or in person. Just a reminder that we have, we can start the Q&A because we have until 8.30 to end the session. Yes, yes. Hey, but I, well, who else? In Kosala, you can speak. Hello, good, good evening, everybody. Good evening. Thank you very much so far. I've learned a lot. You asked that, what am I gonna do differently? So yes. I said, um, with immediate effect, I'm running, I'm rerunning an ad with a better headline. Fantastic. And you have a great voice. Do you know that? Thank you very much. You have a great voice. You pronounce words really, really well. You should use that. You've got a great voice. 
So you maximize that. Yeah, you maximize that. There's a I'll, there's a depth I'll, to your voice. It's powerful. Use it. I'll do that. Thank you very much. Use it. Yes. Somebody else. What what will you do differently because of what you've heard? And then start asking questions. Like I have 15 more minutes to, to go. Any other person? What will you do different because of what you've heard today? All right. Do you have questions to ask? Have you got questions? Any question on sales, on headline? Any question? Uh, okay, let me allow Ogechi to ask a question. Sure. Hello. Hi. I'm sorry, I came on late, quite late, but. It's okay. So, can you hear me clearly? So much, loud and clear. Okay, so what I picked up, maybe I came into the chat room was collaboration because like, I keep hearing the word collaboration, 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 and because the program which I'm selling, my products, what I'm selling, okay. it's more like a program. It's a reading program okay. for kids in the early years. And you oh, mentioned something about our various groups that we find ourselves on. Are we using yes. that space uh, yes. to, uh, as much as we can? So the idea that just struck my mind was, okay, if I'm on this group, why not? Because already I'm posting. I'm already posting on my platform already. But Good. let me, what came into my mind was to take it a bit further. Why not just get these people to market my program for me and get a commission? Mm. That was what just dropped into my mind. I was like, okay, fine. So I'll put it out there. Uh, I'm looking for athletes, market my pro, whatever sale you make, as long as you make sales. I don't know about any other thing you do on the side. But once you make sales, you get a 50% commission. Fantastic. On that commission, on that collaboration that you can do is this. Use what I call the shepherd and the sheep strategy. If you can get the shepherd, you will get all the sheep. If you have a product that helps children read, you want to ask yourself, which company sells products to children? Can I approach that company to buy this product in bulk? Think about it. Quick Teller paid me to come and give you a free talk. You didn't pay for this talk. Quick Teller paid. Are you seeing the strategy now? Mama, where you there? Mama, where you go? <laughs> let me give you guys one example. Okay, AY, let me. AY did this thing. AY did something very powerful during this Christmas period. You know, his movie, as this movie, Christmas in Miami, came out this Christmas period. Those of you who follow him, he did something so profound. He went to meet Access Bank. Access Bank bought a lot of tickets for children in orphanage. Did you see him? So he took buses to carry a lot of those kids in those orphanage and took them to cinema. Are you seeing this? Access Bank paid the children enjoy it. If you sell a product for children, you must be thinking, can I approach a pastor to buy it in bulk and give to the children in the children's church? Can I approach an organization? Oh, I just dropped something deep now. I just hope somebody can get it. Oh my God. Oh. oh. I don't talk finish. Somebody say deep. Mm. Mm. If it say fire. I don't talk finish. You must have way to talk. You don't fly, don't disappear. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let me um so okay. just because of time, if I unmute you, I'm going to ask you if you have a question. If just answer yes. If it's not a question, I'll have to unmute um, you so you can just type in um, what you want to contribute. Um, abol, ab, abol, sorry, excuse me. I'm I'm going to allow it up now. Hello. Okay. 
Yes. I hope you can hear me. Loud yes, we can. we can. Okay, yeah, thank you, uh, Kutela and the coach for the session. I want to ask you very quickly that we had you when you had the conversation with someone and when we also did it with another two people. I would like to ask that. I observe that most of the time, you we are asking this, I mean, the buyer questions. Mm. Then you now explain some answer. Things. Yeah. Can we yeah. have a framework that we can use? I understand. That oh yes. Yeah. Yes. Yes. I I have a, I have a questioning framework. It's in my book, irresistible. But because if you are asking for that, I can actually send the link to all of you. That is, if you subscribe to my newsletter, it's free. So I write a newsletter every Sunday about sales, and it's free. So I'll drop a link here. You can just put your email address there. You'll be getting it every Sunday. And I'll put it in this Sunday as a link for you guys to, uh, for you guys to uh, get. Just a, a little gift to you guys. So it's there. I just put it there. Attendees and partners, you click on that, put your email address there. That's it. Um, you'll get it there on Sunday, yeah. I think that answered that because of our time. I can't go into all the frameworks. I use a lot of frameworks when it works. It's so our last. Thing, just put your email address there and boom. Yeah. Our last question. Last question. To Ibukun. Okay, then you can see I'm in the newsletter. I hope you are enjoying it. Go ahead. Hello, good evening. Hey, Ibukun, do you have a question? Yes, I just want to share something about IG Reels. Good um, when, when, coach, when Coach mentioned the power of Reels, I don't know if I can go ahead. Sure, um, right. if let them know. Okay, all right. Okay, um, um, IG Reels is very helpful and it has really helped me in time past. In October, um, October 22nd to be precise, my daughter's, that was my daughter's birthday. So I posted a real video of are shooting a birthday as in a birthday video and to my surprise the video had 870,000 views what 870,000 views and That's you know we million. were on i think a week to our birthday we were on 5600 followers and followers like yeah, 5,600. And after the birthday, a week, I, I think the al algorithm, the way it works, uh, reels uh, sh uh, normally show for two weeks, like I heard, I'm not, I'm not so sure. And like a week after the birthday, guess where we, we went? We, we went to 19,200 followers just because of that video. I, I'm, I'm a kind of person, we sell baby, baby stuffs, accessories and all that. And you know, I love creating reels every day. I do like three reels every day and it has really worked for me. So people continue posting on reels, your, your product on reels and it will work wonders. Thank you. Wow, you just made this day with this testimony. So powerful. <laughs> Thank you. So powerful, so powerful. Yeah. Thank you guys. That's been a great training, man. I had a great time. Thank Loved you. it. Were you on video? I hope Thank you got you value, so, everybody. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you, Gloria, for having me. Yeah. So this is, um, all right, I'm just going to bring on Temi Tayo to just talk about. I was just in Hello? You were frozen oh, for some seconds. <laughs> Hello? Temi Tayo. Hello, okay. sir. I, I, yes, okay. I didn't get what you said. Hello. You were frozen. Okay, um, I'm just going to go ahead. I can't hear you anymore. So, I, I was just saying, I hope you guys had, I hope you guys got value from the train. I'm just talking to people. Okay. If 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 you found the session very insightful, please just comment. I did, even though I was the you no know, the host, but <laughs> I was actually taking notes. It was a fantastic session. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. All righty. Um, I'm sure I can, you know, ask Mr. I can go now. Question, yeah. 
<laughs> are you running? <laughs> no, no, yes, no. thank you so so much. Thank you so much. I'm just going to bring on Tammy Tayo, our growth marketing manager for Pictella. So if you have um products or services for sale, but you know, maybe a website or a store is too expensive for you to set up, um, we have Pictella um storefront so you can just put up your products for free you can actually just put up everything and we'll help you set up you upload your products and your payment everything will help you facilitate it so she'll just um come on and you know speak more about this platform and if you have any questions please feel free to ask her say mitayo are you ready hi gloria good evening yes i am thank you so much thank you gloria thank you Timitayo. Okay, thank you so much, everyone. Thank you for joining. Thank you, Paul, for your um, real life examples, you know, and tactics to, you know, um, close sales and um, handle customers and grow the business. Uh, but I, even for me, myself, I'm like, wow, this is fantastic, you know. It's also insightful. I can even apply it to my nine to five job. So yes, thank it's you. not just about, you know, making sales as an entrepreneur, but also helps with, you know, your normal day-to-day -day life. So yeah. yes, um, my name is Timmy Tayo. I'm the um, growth marketing manager for Quick Teller Business. And then um, Quick Teller Business is um, a product of um, InterSwitch. And then, um, you know, at InterSwitch, what we do is that we provide solutions for people, not just payment solutions. You would find us in different spaces, you know, we're trying to provide solutions to make your lives better, your lives easier. So that's what we're doing. So for Quick Teller Business, um, it's a platform where you as an entrepreneur, someone that sells, you know, can integrate your business, you know, to make things easier for you. You know, we have built so that you can focus on what is major to you, which is actually closing your sales. So we have built this platform. And um, if, you know, if you have, you know, limitations, let's say, you know, the cost of building a website is expensive, you know, but I want to be out there, aside from selling on Instagram, you know, I want to be able to make sales, make sales that, you know, can be documented properly, you know, the tools to help you with, you know, reporting, reconciliation of all your transactions you have done. Quick Teller is that, um, Quick Teller Business is that platform for you. So you can then um, visit um, business.quickteller.com. I'll drop the link in the chat, just in case you're not signed up yet. You know, you can visit to see what we have to offer and then, um, you know, what you can do on the platform. So on Quick Teller Business, it's um, an online storefront. Um, that's one of the features, actually, where you can list your products and then have a storefront link. So here you're not building a website. We have taken that pain, you know, to do a standard website that would apply to anyone who is on the platform. So you can share these links with your people to let them visit your store perhaps you even sell on instagram as well and you know you have um products that you have displayed on quick teller business you can also upload these products and when it comes to the time for people to make payments you know you can share this payment links with them it makes your you know collection of funds easier so you know when they pay through these payment links you know you can generate invoices you know everything is nice and tidy for your business so aside that we have you know reporting tools like i said when you make sales you can do your reporting and um, what um paul mentioned about you know getting data of your customers in the past you can generate the report of people you've sold to you know you can get their phone numbers so it's easy for you to let's say you want to push out or like call it an email to them or sms blast you know you can get this information from there and if perhaps you're not you just don't have online presence in because i'm sure some people now on this call you know maybe before covid they had physical stores but when covid came realized the importance of you know going online but for your physical space as well we also have you know products that would help you enhance your business so there's one of our new products um, in the block and it's something that if you know you have a physical store and you sell you would need it and you will love it it's called the smart pos so it's like just beyond the pos aside from accepting payments via card you can accept the transfer qr code you can use the verve pay code which is one of our products and then you can also enjoy all of these reporting tools on that platform. Perhaps you have people that walk into your store, they've come to make purchase with their cards and you know they also need cash. You can offer the cash back service and the platform or the POS helps you with reporting properly. And you can even profile it with a charge. So you also get extra income from that. So then 
um, at Quick Teller Business into Switch. For us, you know, at the office, people who work behind to make these things, you know, work properly for you. We don't just leave you with the platform. From time to time, we also support with promotion, you know, like initiatives. This webinar is also one of the initiatives that we do, you know, to help you grow your business. Aside that, we also have a marketing team, which is where I work out of, where we help to push your products from time to time. You know, we identify products. Valentine's season, for example, now we'll be identifying, you know, vendors, you know, that have products, you know, people that are activate or, um, activated already, live merchants, you know, will be like doing a spool of your products to showcase to our own database of customers because we have an ecosystem of different customers. I don't know if you've heard of Quick Teller on its own before, which is like a payment app. There are thousands of customers listed there. So imagine the possibility of us, you know, cross selling. Your business to these people so i i'm sure that you know there's a lot you can benefit from quick tell if you have questions you can ask me i'll drop the link you can also visit the link you know to read more if you have for people that signed up already you know maybe you just have some things you want to ask and maybe you've not been able to ask anyone please you know reach out to me and thank you so so much again for joining this session i'm sure everybody got value i wouldn't want to ask did you get value because i know you got value Thank you so much. And thank you so much for being patient with me. I had network issues at the beginning, but here I am. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Semitayo. Um, I wanted to just so ask, much. I think the, there's a question. Someone was like, she started the process, but couldn't um, navigate it. So basically it was, it's on pause. So is there like an email address or like a support um, team or something that they can reach out to for assistance? Okay, yes. Um, so there's a support team, but for the person that dropped that, please drop your, I'm trying to look at the chat. Please just um, drop that message again. So in fact, we would reach out to you. So you don't even have to hustle. We'll reach out to you. Then I'll also get you the um, support team email and I'll drop it in the message as well. Yes, if I'm mad, there's a tutorial to start up. Um, let me drop the link to our, to our YouTube. Jane, no. If you have issues just with the platform, just drop your email address and we'll reach out to you. Thank you so much once again, Paul. That was an amazing session. Thank you. Thank Thanks, you. Thank you. Thank you, Tammy Tayo. Thank, thank you, everyone. Thank you so much. You can just drop the YouTube link. Thank you, everybody. Thank you, Paul. Thank you, Gloria, for hosting us. You too. Have a safe trip thank back you, home. Thank you, Gloria, for hosting us. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Have a safe trip back home. Heading to, the, heading to the island from Ikeja. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. Yeah, bye. Yeah. All right. I've dropped the YouTube link. So you can just watch the videos. Tim Tyra, if you are available, you can also you can also um just answer for example bisante says do you have a referral code mlt program that i use to track customers hey, gloria let me just look through the chats now so i can pick the ones and then provide answers to them Okay, I have email addresses for Daniela Omosisa and Pamela Walter. Hope I didn't miss any email. If you have any okay. issues, platform. Okay, sorry. Okay, um, okay yeah, Gloria. 
Okay, um, I'm seeing John's question. Um, how can Quickteller help to facilitate sales of my products? So, um, John, it would be lovely to know if you have um, an active store. That means you have uploaded all of your products um, on the platform and what kind of products you sell. And um, so once you have that, you know, just drop your email address and your store name and we'll review and, you know, would help to push this season to see what comes out of that for you. Okay, so Daniela, okay, we've seen your email, so we'll reach out, we'll reach out to you. Thank you. Okay, um, yes, we'll, we'll share the um, video with everyone, so not to worry. All right, so that brings us to the end of our session. Thank you so much again, everyone. Um, have a lovely evening. Bye. Thank you, Gloria. Good night. Thank you, everyone. I love African food and I've always wanted to start a business that makes it very easy. Harry!